Hi, my name is Marion and I recently launched Cellgenic Skin for the Future. I'd like to talk to you today about looking after your skin, not just by putting great products on your skin which don't contain toxic chemicals, but looking at what you put into your body which can affect your skin. And the subject today is sugar. I call this 10 good reasons why you shouldn't eat sugar and 10 good reasons why it'll help to save your skin. And the first reason is that sugar depletes you of essential B vitamins and minerals uh, which would otherwise be used for your skin. Uh, the second reason is that sugar is not absorbed in your, your mouth or your stomach. It goes straight to your large intestine and then into your bloodstream. And the third reason which follows on from that is that uh, sugar will feed gut uh, bacteria, parasites, candida, yeast. You may have noticed that if you suffer from a bloated stomach, uh, if, when you give up sugar, very often you'll find a big change in, in how your stomach bloats. And the fourth reason is that sugar um, depletes your immune system of vitamin C, which is essential. The fifth reason is that sugar, in depleting you of vitamin C, actually um, will affect how you produce collagen. You have to have vitamin C to make collagen. That is scientifically known. And the sixth reason is that sugar makes you very vulnerable to free radical damage because your immune system is not functioning properly. Sugar in itself, which is reason number seven, actually will cause free radical damage. Um, number eight is that sugar makes you very acidic. You've probably noticed if you eat sugar at Christmas, um, you very often will come out in a rash of spots afterwards and uh, you generally actually don't feel great. Um, part of that acidity, um, which I'll include in number eight, is that sugar actually affects how your adrenals function as well. Uh, number nine is that sugar interferes with how enzymes function and part of that is how you produce hormones. And if you don't produce enough oestrogen, that will contribute to speeding up the aging process. And the tenth reason is that the more sugar you eat, the more sugar you want to eat. It's very, very addictive. And the type of sugar that I'm talking about is the sugar that you get in chocolates, in sweets, in biscuits and cakes, and um, sugar in processed foods. It's a very salutary exercise to look at the sugar in processed foods. You will be astounded how much sugar is there. It's there for a reason. It makes it taste nice. But uh, yes, you want to go and uh, eat more, and of course, then you go and buy more. So um, the producers of the, of the processed foods are making a lot of money out of putting sugar into their foods. If you want to know more about sugar, there's a great book you can get and it's called Sugar Blues and it's by William Dufty, which is D-U-F-T-Y and you can find it on Amazon. So I hope this has given you some idea of actually how you can look after your skin, as I say, not just by what you put on your skin, but really looking at what you put into your body which will affect your skin. Many thanks.